to perfection and I wanted to let go of all control and the action paint on the tracks that follow. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking at the time, but then I wanted to give my guests the idea that they are dining in a dream. <laughs> Inspired by the great Salvador Dali. and ask myself, what is it there? Hmm. Inspired by the budget painter René Magritte. After this, I had the idea to sell all my courses in soup cans. Not one, not two, not three, but nine courses of soup. Yeah. Soup as long with bush, soup as appetizer, soup as main course, soup as dessert. Inspired by the American pop artist Andy Warhol. Then I went ahead and wrapped the hot plate and table in fabric like the famous artist Crypto. Finally, I discovered the most genius artist of them all, Marcel Duchamp. He took a bicycle wheel, yes, you heard me right, a bicycle wheel, and called it a piece of art. And this wheel became one of the most influential artworks of the 20th century. So I said to myself, I'm going to put a piece of bread on a plate and call it fine dining. Yeah. <laughs> voilà, finito, my job is done. Bon appétit. Well, honestly, maybe for Marcel it worked, but my customers said that my food became way too artsy farty and nobody came anymore to my restaurant. So, then I told myself I need to stop trying to reinvent dining and just go back to the basics of plating. Texture, color, and, and composition. The portrait without the Let me present to you tonight's dish. Yeah. Oh, you sure enjoy. Thank you. Russian painter, Vasily Kandinsky. Just like an artist, I want people's mouths to fall open when they see the dish placed in front of them. And I hope I succeeded once again today. Bon appétit. Thank you. 